Oh man, let me log into this crazy Keela's life on YouTube, man. See what all the bugs is about. Become a lunatic like all these other people. It's crazy Keela. Crazy Keela's life. It's crazy Keela. Crazy Keela's life. Crazy Keela. Crazy Keela. Crazy Keela. Crazy Keela. It's crazy Keela. Crazy Keela's life. Like, comment, subscribe, become a lunatic. Good morning, everybody. I'm driving I'm to school, and it looks kind of dreary in here. Hold on, let me see. Is that my camera? No? It's just how I look in here, honey. Um, We're on our way to drop my to school. Today is day one of our fast day. Um, um, after I do this fast, um, I do plan on I'm doing three day of no food, just water. And maybe like, it's a clean fast, so it's like tea with nothing in it. And like, when I say tea, it's gonna be tea. Um, you can do regular tea with nothing in it. Like, or eat like green tea, like that, or something with nothing in it. Or you can do um, hot water and salt. Or you can do, hot water with um, apple cider vinegar and lemon juice. And that's probably what I'm gonna do because I, I know that I do that anyway. This morning so far, all I had is I, um, I didn't get to read my, the kids were, they, they, they were a little behind this morning. Actually, we like 13 minutes behind. Not that we're gonna be late, but we're just behind time. Um, So, um, I, drunk my apple cider vinegar and water, a little thing of water. Um, I'm gonna take my vitamins because it's, it's good to take vitamins while you're on these fast because your body is not getting any nutrition, you know what I'm saying? So you have to get your nutrition the best way you can. Then, um, but I take vitamins anyway, so, but just to, to people that don't take vitamins, you should take vitamins every day, but especially when you're fasting, okay? So after I'm done this three day fast, when I get home, I'm gonna do my devotionals because I didn't get a chance to do it because the kids were all over the place this morning and they woke up earlier than I expected. Usually I try to get that stuff done. By the time I got out the bathroom, they were already up. So um, I said, you know what, what I'm gonna have to do now is before I jump in the shower, go to the bathroom, jump in the shower, I'm gonna go ahead and do my prayer, my devotional before that because they will query me, okay? So, we are going to um, do these three day fasts, and I'm going to just kind of meditate and find peace within myself. And then, after that, I'm gonna do ADF. Um, ADS is, is alternate day fast. So, once I break my fast on Thursday, because this is Monday, once I break my fast on Thursday, that's going to be my feast day. And the way I'm doing alternate day fasting is different than some people do it. I might change it up later, but I do, I'm do. i doing it different than some people do it. Um, so the, the more aggressive, they have different types of fasting for ADF. The more aggressive one is 36 hours. Now, I mean, I'm going to do 36 hours, but I'm going to put a little spin on it. Because when the weekends are my time to socialize and do stuff, my husband. So I'm gonna fast Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Okay. Now, the only thing with Fridays, I'm gonna eat a, a meal. I'm gonna do a one a day fast, one one meal a day that day. But it's gonna meal is gonna be under 500 calories. Now they do have an awesome day fast, and we do fat every other day. And the day that you're fasting, you do eat, but you're eating under 500 calories a day, okay? That day. So, or you fast for 24 days. I want you to fast for 24 hours, and then when you break your fast, you're eating 500 calories, 500 to 700 calories a day for those days, for the fasting days. Then they got um, the 36-hour fast where 
but they call it sun, sun now. So you fast every other day, and every other day you don't eat anything. And then in the feast days, you eat whatever you I decided I gotta do what works for me what I think I'll be able to stick to. What I'll be able to stick to, and like I said, some Fridays I'm gonna go all day without eating. I'm gonna spin it up. But if I got a date night or something, I will go out to eat and I will eat minimum. I will eat something high protein, low carb, low calorie, okay, and water. But on my, um, if I'm not going anywhere and I'm not doing anything, I'll stick to the 36 hour fast and I'm going to eat to Saturday. And like I said, that's going to be a little bit tough because I do a really strenuous workout, but when, I feel like on Saturday, so once I get used to it, I think I'll be fine. So, what I might do since I'm going to be doing that, before I go exercise, I will go eat something. I will eat something. I'll wake up early enough to fix me something to eat because I don't want to go to the gym on an empty stomach and I ain't eating 36 hours, you know what I'm saying? And the gym open at seven. So what I might do is get up in the morning, make me a bacon, egg, and cheese bagel or something, something hearty, or bacon, egg, and cheese sandwich on wheat or something, something hearty that I can, um, and I said, I'm trying to stay away from cheese. So I'll do a bacon and egg sandwich without the cheese. Um, something hearty that I can eat and don't have to worry about, okay, is it, um, because I'm trying to cut down on dairy too. Because I stay constipated and I don't know. And sometimes I eat dairy and my, I love dairy. But my stomach get upset. So I'm going to try to stay away from it and see what my body does. Okay. So um, I'm going to try to say. And the crazy thing about it is that. But I'm going to tell you. Once I finish this fast, I'm going to finish this ice cream I got. Because my husband went and bought me some ice cream. I, I said, well, why, why would you do that? Well, I know you like this ice cream. That's very thoughtful of him. Because I did not tell him I was going to cut my dairy out. So that was very thoughtful him, of him. But, you know what? I ain't going to eat that ice cream. I'm going to let him eat it. Because he like butter pecan ice cream. I'm going to let him eat that butter pecan ice cream. Because I got to cut this dairy out. Because if I say I'm going to do something, I got to do what I said I'm going to do. Okay? Trying to cut off sweets unless it's a special occasion. What I mean like make that... You know, for birthday parties, we have cakes. For graduation, my daughter's graduation, we're having cakes. I'm not going to go crazy and eat a ton of cake. A slice. A normal slice. Not, not one of my slices that I usually get that a chunk. No, it's going to be a normal slice. A normal little slice. A slither slice. A, a diabetic slice, okay? That's what I'm going to call it. Diabetic slice. That's what I'm going to eat. Hold on, y'all. That's my husband hauling. Hey y'all, so I'm home and I was talking to my husband, that's why I didn't got the phone in the car. About to make that man sandwich. Sandwich, okay? Um, but I am about to read this when I'm done and I'm gonna take some time to pray. Then I'm gonna work start some of the work that I gotta do for today. I got some um writing to do and some editing to do. So um yeah. But um, back to what I was saying about the fasting, like the 36 hour fast is very aggressive. It's like, let's say you do fast Monday, you eat Tuesday, but when you fast Monday, you fast from Sunday night when you go to sleep to Tuesday morning when you wake up, okay? When you, and that's how it goes, back and forth. Now they got another fast, like I said, it's still an alternate day fast, but on that Monday, instead of not eating at all that night, that Monday night, you would eat something less between five and 700 calories or less than 500 calories or no higher than 700 calories, if I can understand it correctly. Everybody do it a little bit different, but the way I'm doing it is I'm doing 36 hour fast. Mondays, Wednesdays, and Friday, I'm going to do a 36-hour fast if I don't have a date night. But if not, I'm going to do the 24-hour fast, and I'm going to eat something that's under 700 calories when I go out to eat. And, um, yeah, so that's what I'm going to do. But, um, yeah, y'all, I'm just i taking you on this journey with me so y'all can see how it is. And then after this, I will take you guys and do some vlogging on my um results from my alternate day fasting and what i'm trying to achieve most people say if you have fog i get a lot of um foggy like what is it 
what do they call it? like burn I can't even look I can't even think now it's like when you can't get your thoughts together and thoughts straight and I want to help that and I heard it's, it's pretty healthy a lot of if you got ailments and I don't have a lot of ailments but they said body aches my body do be aching y'all they be aching so they said if you got body aches it helps with body aches this one lady said she was um like if you sick and have ailments it, it helps them I don't have any illness, but I don't want to have any. And I'm getting older, y'all. I'm getting older. I don't want to worry about having diabetes. My mama has diabetes. She has high blood pressure. She has sarcoidosis. It's a lot of things that she deals with and things that I don't necessarily want to deal with because I see how they affect her. You know what I'm saying? Who wants to deal with ailments and stuff when you don't have to? You get what I'm saying? So, with all that being said, I'm going to take y'all on this journey with me. This is just the first day. And I don't really think I'm going to be talking this much the rest of the day. I was just trying to explain to y'all what I'm doing for my three-day fast. When I start the alternate day fast, I'll do a separate video. But I'm doing the three-day fast, and it's self-explanatory. I'm just going to kind of use you guys as a diary to see how I'm feeling and what's going on with me. When y'all see this video, y'all y'all going to see this video before y'all see my weekend vlog because you're not supposed to tell somebody when you're fasting. So, um... And I already put, I already put, oh, I need another piece of meat. You're not supposed to tell nobody when you're fasting. So, um, you can tell them after you fast. That's what I'm thinking because they just said you don't tell them while you're fasting. So, I'm not going to post my weekend vlog. My weekend vlog talk about me doing my 3 day fast. And I'm, I'm going to post this one after my weekend vlog so that, no, that sound after. I'm going to post this. After I finish fasting. And I'm going to post my weekend vlog after I finish fasting. Probably going to post my weekend vlog first. And then post this. But it's going to be after I finish my three day fast. Because honey. I'm trying to stick to it. And do what I got to do. To. Hey fat man. Sandwich. Yeah. So. Let me go ahead and read my. Deli devotional. Bought this from Walmart. It's really good. You don't have to get this one, but you should pick up a daily devotional. And I'm gonna start reading my man manifest um book so that um manifest three six six nine. Yeah, I'm gonna start reading that so I can start manifesting. And I forgot to give her my her vitamins this morning. Do it, bad man. Don't forget your vitamins. I get very well. When she get home, oh. okay. I'll let y'all a minute. Hey y'all, so I'm on my way to go pick up Amaya. So far, it's almost two o'clock, and I haven't gotten hungry yet. That tells you something. I think we get so used to planning meals for breakfast, lunch, and dinner because out of habit, and a lot of times we're not really hungry. So we're eating unnecessary food. But I have I've been drinking a lot of water, but I've been fine. My husband's trying to say, oh, you're gonna be starving by the night. I said, don't say that. No, I won't. No, I won't. I'm gonna be fine. Keep drinking my water and I'm fine. And I'm hydrated. So I'm picking the money up. I'll get back at y'all to let y'all know with the end. By the time I go to sleep with day one was like for me, but it was so chill. Like I didn't have to worry about cleaning up dishes from clean from cooking something. Cause y'all know I cook breakfast every morning. You all right, baby? Did he just, I can't see back there y'all. I just heard him sneeze. It's not like snot came out, but it sounded like he sniffed it back in his nose. I don't see no snot. I don't know. But anyway, yeah, so I'm just going to keep drinking my water, staying hydrated. I might drink some warm tea tonight, where I say not really tea, just hot water, but, um, apple cider vinegar and lemon juice. I'm drink that before I go to bed and go to bed. That's what I'm But I'll let y'all know what I'm proud of feeling tonight and um, when I do that. I'll probably in the bed when I'll be in the bed when I do that um, that part of the video. That's what I'm gonna do. In the morning I'll do the video in the morning on the way to school. 
and then I'll do one in the afternoon when I gotta pick up Amaya so y'all can see how my day has gone so far and then y'all will see another clip when I'm going to bed to let y'all know so this is only day one so we, we don't pace ourselves honey because we don't know what take two day two and day three don't, don't bring for us honey but today's been a good day so far Good morning, people. I am doing good timing this morning. I'm a few minutes behind, but not really that much because, you know. So, the day is going well. So far, I just woke up, so I got myself together. So, But yesterday, I forgot to um, let y'all know how everything went for the whole day. I really did not get hungry all day. Still haven't eaten. Um, I decided I'm going to do a devotional at night because when I was reading that devotional book, it just seems like it's like a recap of what, like, it, it seemed like a recap of what that day is, not instead of the morning. It just seemed like I'm supposed to be reading it at night. So I'm going to read it tonight. I read it yesterday during the day, but when I was reading, I was like, it almost felt, and it's not the first time I felt like that. So I'm like, maybe I'm supposed to be reading this at night. So I'm going to start reading it at night. So I'm feeling amazing. I am. Um, huh? I don't know. Your thigh is itching? Oh, okay. I know what she was saying. But, yeah. Um, this is day two. Tuesday, day two. And, um, people just don't know how to drive out here. Like, they be speeding. This is not an area where you need to be speeding at. It's not a race. Tell them. It's not a race. They're going to get to where they need to get to. And now I'm going to drive slow because they want to be on my tail. Want to be on my tail? We're going to drive slow now. You ain't going to get no way. You got to get faster than driving on my tail. But, uh, yeah. Um, I did take my vitamins this morning. And I do have my trusty dusty water. I drank three of these yesterday. So, let's see how I do today. <laughs> but I've been drinking an awful lot An awful lot But I'm supposed to I stay hydrated and doing, I need to stay hydrated anyway But especially during this whole you know, And that's my You know you know, I, I, I've been praying and asking for strength And asking for clarity And stuff But it's crazy though Because I think sometimes We just don't drink enough water Because if we drunk enough water we wouldn't be half as thirsty that we usually, you know, are. And me and my girlfriend was talking about yesterday how um, in other countries, the portions that we eat are ridiculous. In other countries, the portions that we eat are ridiculous. So, that tells you something. We eat too much. So, um, but I'm doing great. Um... <laughs> Today is, like I said, got one more day and that's tomorrow and then I'll be done. But I ain't gonna lie, yesterday I was thinking about a little bit. Things I ain't ate in a long time. I was like, dang, spinach dip and some nachos would be real good right now. When I wasn't hungry, I felt like I was lusting at the food because I wasn't hungry. I wasn't hungry. I wasn't having my, my sister said she had like hunger pains and stuff. I didn't get any of that. I was lusting at the food. And they say gluttony is a sin. Find it sin, sin demon in the name of Jesus. Because I was less than at the food. I was. But um, I was fine. So I drank some water and said, Gotta give me strength. <laughs> but I holler at y'all again around, I guess, at lunchtime to let y'all know how I'm doing. Or maybe just dinner time. I'm not sure. I don't like to commit to when I'm going to get back to y'all doing this little journey because uh, it's not really nothing going on to really update you. Now, and if I decide, if I start getting hungry or something else, dramatic changes, then I get at y'all earlier than tonight. But if nothing dramatic changes, then I will get to y'all to tonight or tomorrow. All right? I'll let y'all later. Hey, y'all. So... Yeah, um, I start reaching hunger around three something this afternoon. I didn't have anything to eat. 
But I don't know. Let me rephrase that. I wasn't hungry because I'm still not hungry. And it's been over 48 hours. Tomorrow will be the last day of the fast. And then I'll eat on um, Thursday morning. But And then I'm going to go to the gym. And I got some stuff to do with my mom. But the hunger did. I keep saying hunger. It wasn't hunger. I'm going to tell you why. Because I didn't have any, have any hunger pains. I wasn't like having that hungry feeling. It's just like I was having cravings. Like I was lusting at the food. And I'm going to say lusting because it's like a, a sin. Like gluttony. It's gluttony. I was gluttoning at the food. I'm just gl gl I'm, I was in sin. But I got my apple cider vinegar and lemon and hot water. And um, I've been drinking water all day with lemon in it. Like a cap full of lemon, just like 36 ounces of water. Thirty Is it 36 or 32? I think it's 32 ounces of water. With, um, I would fill my water bottle up. It's 32 ounces and then put a cap of lemon juice in it. And I drink that all day. It helped. And I did drink some um, salt water before I went on a walk with my friend. And I drank the salt water like at 6. And we went on the walk of seven. So, because I, I wanted to have electrolytes if I was walking and drinking salt water helps you get electrolytes. So, as far as my last day, it was rough. Today, after three something, it was rough. I mean, it was a breeze before that. I was like, ain't nothing. You know what I'm saying? But I'm about to do my affirmation. I know y'all told y'all I was going to start doing this at night because it seems like by reading it, I, I shouldn't have to do it. I should be doing it at night. So I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to go to bed after I drink this um, hot water with this um, apple cider vinegar and lemon juice. But yeah, I'll holler at y'all tomorrow. Hey y'all. So it's Wednesday and it's day two. I mean, day three, I'm sorry. Day three of my three-day fast. And I got to go to the grocery store today. Not to get no heavy groceries, but to get some fruits and stuff. And some milk. Yeah. So, I think I want to pick up some bone broth. But, I, I'll be honest with you, I don't think I... I wanted to break my fast with bone broth, but I, I really didn't think I want a Chick-fil-A sandwich for my first. Break my fast. Chick-fil-A sandwich. That's what I want. So, mm, we'll see, we will see. We shall see. Um, but I really originally wanted to break my fast with bone broth. Mm, and I still got to think about that. Um, today, I'm going I'm to do some reading. But it's crazy because since I've been fasting, I've been super tired. So, I go to read, and I, I go, I, as soon as I start reading, I just start dozing off. I can be like, you know what I'm saying? So, I don't know what the, all that's about, but, yeah, um, I, like I said, um, we, it's, it's, a, it's a lot. It's just, it's, it's, at the beginning of the first day, it was a breeze. Half of the second day yesterday, it was a breeze, and then I start having, like, thoughts of food. And, like I said, it wasn't hunger. It was just me wanting food. You know what I'm saying? It, it, I wasn't hungry. I wasn't. And it's a difference. It's a, it's a difference for ju just wanting to eat and being hungry. I just wanted to eat. I wasn't hungry. And I need to start getting some gas on my mouth. But it, 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 this is what I'm saying. It, it, I wasn't hungry. You know. Get out the street, bird. What is this bird at? No, he, she got to get out the street. I don't know why he going to sit in the street. Well he, well, he need to get out the street before he get hit. Bird. You must have drove on it. No, I didn't. He you flew. No, I didn't. It. He flew away. Well, that car might drive on his wings because he act like he don't want to move. But, um, because he done flew to the other side of the road, but he act slow to, to, to get out I the way. But, um, I, but I, I did do a team move haul yesterday. Well, I mean, it was... I got some stuff in for table. I was really satisfied. I was really satisfied. And I don't know what it is, but since I've been fasting, I've been super tired. Don't know what that's about, but I've been super tired. So, yeah. So, just keep me in your prayers as I do this thing, honey. But I'm on my way to, like I said, dropping my off. I try to do a midday um, 
If not, I'll do a nighttime one to let you know how it all went. And that'll be the end of this three days as a vlog. But I just wanted to kind of tell you how I was feeling. I actually feel good. I always feel good when I first wake up. I don't be hungry or nothing. The first day I went hungry all day. Yesterday I went hungry and I woke up. I was fine. And it's like when it got to the afternoon, that that guy, Amaya, she wanted to eat all these different foods. And I'd be like, you know, but, but let me go ahead. I'll holler at y'all later on tonight. Yeah. Hey, y'all. So, I got my on. thank you. Yesterday, I didn't get to um, update y'all because my husband had um, my brother in law and my nephew came over, and my um, my husband's friend that his one of his childhood friends that you know, he actually was in our wedding, he came out with his wife, and so. I was, you know, entertaining, and I ain't gonna lie. My brother-in-law came over and cooked. That's why I went upstairs when he cooked. I came downstairs and my mother-in-law came too. My mother-in-law came too, and she was like, "Can't come downstairs, Jimmy and I'm here." And I was like, "Oh, okay," because you know I'm an entertainer type person. I'm not gonna just be gone and everybody be like, "Well, where your wife at?" See, my you know, brother-in-law already knew that I was fast, and I told him, "Look, when you start cooking and stuff." And I start smelling that food. I'm going upstairs. So I stayed down long as I can. And I start smelling the food. I said, all right, well, I'm about to go upstairs. But when um, Jimmy and his wife came, I was like, you know what? I need to come and I need to be hosting my guests. You get what I'm saying? That's just the, that's just the kind of wife I am. I, I came downstairs. Remember, I came back downstairs with y'all. Remember, y'all had already ate. Remember? That was so good. You like that food? I know you liked it because you ate Fat Man's too. <laughs> but, uh, Sammy came back and, and he saw me Yeah, I might say, can I eat Fat Man's because he didn't finish his food. I said, go on, girl. So, um, yeah, yesterday was hard. I did get a headache. I woke up this morning with a headache. So, I'm probably kind of glad that I did vlog, um, record it this morning so I can tell you, like, how I felt the day after the whole three-day fast. I mean, I had a really bad headache when I woke up this morning. And I think the reason I got such a bad headache yesterday because everybody was talking and laughing and everything was loud. Um, I didn't get, and I was tired when you're not eating your, your, your body, food is your fuel. So now your body is working on burning your fat. It's not, you don't have any food in your body as food. So, um, so I was getting headaches because I forgot to drink my um, hot salt water. I noticed that night when I was cleaning up, I said, why this head, my head is, you know, I need to do something. I've been drinking water. I don't know what's wrong. I said, let me, I forgot to drink my salt water and which I drink the salt. I used to drink the salt water like, like five something, but everybody was, you know, coming over and stuff. So I didn't need to think to drink it. So I drank it and I did feel a lot better. So y'all is doing fasting. When you feeling like you're missing something, it's my, it might be electrolytes. Um, so I drank that and I was fine. I was completely fine. I was completely fine. So yeah, now that I'm done. Today I get to eat, but I'm starting at ADF. This is gonna be my first day at ADF, but this is gonna be my fast day. So I'm about to start vlogs on what I eat on my fast days. I don't have to vlog anything when I don't eat because what am I gonna vlog? Me looking at the ear. Okay, so my alternate day fasting is gonna consist of Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. But the exception is Fridays. I fast till seven, seven o'clock, and I eat. Um, I fast to seven o'clock, and then at um at seven o'clock at the, at seven o'clock I can eat something. But it has to be between five and seven hundred calories. It can't be more higher than that. And the reason I say that because sometimes we do date nights. The time that we don't do date nights, so we're not doing anything. I'm just gonna go ahead and fast all the way through to Saturday. But the days that we do have date nights and stuff, I don't want to, you know, we go out and eat and stuff. And I'm gonna look at my husband while he eating. I have looked at menus and found stuff that was under like if I decide to go up here of chains. They got the dynamite, the dynamite oh, um, shrimp thing. It's only 640 calories. No, it ain't. It's actually less than that. It's 400 and some calories. 600 and some calories is the sushi, the sushi, dynamite sushi. So I would be able to eat sushi. I would probably eat the shrimp, to be honest, the, dy the dynamite shrimp bowl. And the reason I would probably eat that is because it has like 20 grams of protein. 
who don't want to eat 20 grams of protein? Y'all, I'm going to eat that. I looked at the thing. I said, that's going to be my Friday spot. I, I'm sure there's other spots, but I got to look at other menus to see what the calorie count is, you know, because I want to stay within my range, honey. Because if that's what it is, then I'll still be under 500. That's what I'm saying for P.F. Chain. And I'm not really a big... I used to like P.F. Chains a lot, but the last couple of times I went in for this... It didn't, it didn't rub me the right way. It just didn't taste the way it needed to taste. It wasn't doing what it needed to do, okay? So what I might probably do is try to do most of my date nights, to be honest, on Saturdays. That way I don't have to worry about the calorie count. I can just fast. But if we do do it on Fridays, I'm telling my husband, we got to go to a place where I done looked at the menu and I know exactly what I'm going to get because I know what the calorie count is because I'm not eating all that day. So... Um, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday is going to be, I want to say they're going to be my fast days. But what I'm going to do is Saturday is going to be my fast day. And Sunday, I'm going to eat because y'all know I cook dinner. But I'm going to, like, eat one meal. I'm going to eat one meal. I'm not going to eat breakfast. I'm going to take my walk that morning. I'm not going to eat breakfast. I'm, and that's going to be good for me because yeah, I got to get ready for church. So I don't, be have, I be cooking breakfast and rushing, trying to get stuff cleaned up before I left, leave. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, 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 just cook dinner and fix dinner and eat dinner. So I'm gonna eat one meal a day. I'm not gonna count my calories for the Sunday meal because I need to eat enough that I'm fat when I fast Monday. I'm not thrown off, you hear what I'm saying? So that's how I'm gonna do my alternate day fast. And I mean, I modified it so I can actually do it and stick to it. Um, I'm not gonna um, everybody can do things their own way that's how I decide to do it like I said Monday and Wednesday I'm gonna do a complete 36 hour fast um, but yeah and I plan on doing that on Friday unless I have a date night and if I have a date night I'll do a 24 hour fast and I will eat something between five and seven hundred calories or underneath 500 calories I won't go over 700 calories so for that that meal but yeah so I'll holler at y'all later because I got to start recording for my feast. Today I'm having a feast day. Girl, I'm going to eat, honey. I'm going to eat. But you know what? I got a feeling I'm not going to really be that hungry because I'm not really that hungry right now. I'm not. But I'm going to tell you something. I'm about to get a chicken, a chicken, egg, and cheese biscuit from, from Chick-fil-A when I get off this this vlog after I drop my mic off. And that's all period. I'll holler at y'all later. Um, if y'all went down to know anything about that, I mean, I mean, I have put in here about how I got through that. I think I told y'all everything. Just comment below. But, you know, it was difficult. The first day was a breeze. The second day got a little bit harder. The third day was really difficult because I started getting headaches and stuff like that. And I think, I, like I said, I think that was because the first two days I did drink the salt water. And I did drink, drink the, um, the, the apple cider vinegar with the lemon. That last day, I didn't do, I didn't do that, and I think that really affected my um, my progress and, uh, and, and and how I was feeling because I was doing good at the beginning, but by one o'clock, yeah, I was like, mm, I just want a grape, a cheese doodle, a, a nacho, something. I just need some, just one. I was thinking maybe if I just eat one just to curb this appetite and it wasn't because I was hungry I promise y'all because I wasn't hungry I was lusting at food and I got a headache I got a headache because I wasn't because I, I was drinking plenty of water but I didn't get any electrolytes because I forgot to drink my dang salt water I didn't get the headache I was a little hungry and I'm going to say hungry I think I just have a lust for food sometimes and when you hadn't seen it and you see everybody else eat you be like dang your mind is telling you man everybody else eating why you can't eat food feeling like neglected like you neglecting your, your taste buds not even your stomach because my stomach is fine i was I, it was my taste buds that went in it not my stomach my taste buds tell me but like comment subscribe hit that notification bell because i'm gonna be doing adf fasting vlogs um fasting over the days i'm fasting i'm gonna try to record some of the days i'm not gonna record all of these i ain't gonna sit up and tell y'all like Every time I'm fasting, I'm going to be recording everything I eat. I'm a, I'm a mama. 
become a wife. I'm the house manager. I'm the everything in my home. I am every woman. I don't really have time to do that every day. That's why I stopped doing the weekly fast, the weekly fast, the weekly um, vlogs because it required me to vlog every day and I really don't have time. But like I said, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell, boo. Come a lunatic. Cause you don't mean lunatic. You crazy, sexy, and cool. Peace. <laughs>